All right, let's go ahead and move our plate out of the way. I'm gonna wanna go scrub that down anyway. I need to get that O-ring out of there. Here's our new yellow O-ring. That'll sit there. Yes, it looks like there is an O-ring there at that STC fitting as well. And that's what this little black one is. All right. So, oh, there's the, there's the old O-ring out there. We'll put our new O-ring there. I'll clean it off. All right. Now we will go get our high pressure oil pump and get that set into place. All right, we've got our new O rings in place. place. Got my big three torques started. I'm just starting them. I'm not tightening them down yet. To get my hardware for the STC. The kit actually came with all new hardware. How about that? Just reuse my three old bolts though. No reason not to. fitting appears to be lining up perfectly. I need to get my torque wrench and we shall start torquing things down. First I want to go ahead and clean down the H-pop cover. You see the back of it's still filthy. Okay evidently I wasn't recording as I torqued that down. The, T, the three Torx bolts go down to 23 foot-pounds and the two small STC fitting ones, or two small bolts for the STC fitting, go to 10 foot pounds. Sorry about that. All right, so we've got our nice cleaned off plate here. And go ahead and start gasket in here. And again, same thing on this gasket. Uh, there's a lip with the two, the two rings. You should see that when you go, set this up on there. That single edge is what will be sitting out, pointing upward, if you will. Make sure you get your gasket all the way in. Now one thing I found interesting is the, uh, the Hylomar, the gasket sealer, along this edge. And this also has a ray, an extra raised lip through there. So I don't know if that Hylomar is actually required. Let's see if you can see this. The lip comes up along here and is actually raised, assuming for you know extra sealing. All right, so we've got our cover here. Now along the back there, I need to clean that area out and get it ready to put a little form of gasket sealing in there. Make sure that I have no leaks. On that area. All right. Make sure it's clean back there. Now that's this side of my gasket, or of my um, high pressure cover. So all I'm going to do is put a little bit right along here. And along here at the corners. 
very small bead. This is just to help this seal down. I'm not looking to do anything major with it. Take this, cover, put it back there in place. We're ready to get all our bolts back in. And these guys only go down to like six foot pounds. All right, now we've got our high pressure oil pump fully installed. Next, we need to get our injector pressure regulator and we need to go ahead and refurb it.